And we all know that a dynasty can't be built overnight, but the past three seasons, it sure seems like the New Hanover baseball team is well on their way to accomplishing just that. It was just one swing of the bat on Saturday night that sent the New Hanover Wildcats to the state championship series for the third straight year. It took everything the Wildcats had after falling behind one to nothing in the eighth inning, but if we know one thing about New Hanover, they're resilient. You know, we had to stay focused, you know, even being down one nothing there at the end, you got to stay calm, cool, and collected, and you know, still battle and put up one run there, and then eventually we got that second run, which was huge to get the win. New Hanover has 11 seniors on this year's roster, and they've compiled a 93-16 and record over their four years of high school, and now they're looking for their second state title to go along with it. It's been really great to just, you know, kind of end it on a high note, and we're going to try to get the state championship this weekend, but it feels like the past three years for us seniors, it's been kind of a continuous ride, and we're just trying to get that last one. The only thing standing in the way of the Wildcats pulling off back-to-back -back state championships is Marvin Ridge High School. The Mavericks are the number 10 seed in the state tournament, but New Hanover knows no one can be taken lightly this time of year. If you don't bring it, man, they're going to they're gonna send you home with an L. I think the guys have done a great job of, of, of playing with uh, focus and passion every time out, you know, and it's, uh, it's a testament to them. The year's been full of excitement for the Wildcats. Now they say it's time to put a bow on it. I mean, we've had a crazy playoff run this year, won some really big games. I mean, there's nothing that we want more than just to win one more.